St. Lucia and the University of Vermont proudly recognized two decades of a strong and mutually beneficial partnership that has significantly impacted various sectors within the island nation. A project's presentation and closing ceremony was held recently and was attended by key officials, stakeholders, students and other representatives from both St. Lucia and the University of Vermont. The Deputy Permanent Secretary within the Ministry of Commerce, Manufacturing, Business Development, Cooperatives and Consumer Affairs, Mrs. Charmaine Louis-Justin, highlighted the substantial advantages that St. Lucia has gained from this enduring collaboration. She expressed her gratitude for the support and the positive impact it has had on the country over the years. Secretary, I am acutely aware of the impact that this long-standing relationship with the University of Vermont has had and continues to have on not only the work and sh sharpened skill set of our department, but on the wider community as well. From the commissioning of the computer labs and school gardening to the undertaking of useful data-driven impact surveys. Thanks to the collaboration with the UVM, our staff have received valuable training in areas relevant to the department's function, including consumer law, research techniques and methods, and report writing. One of the key achievements mentioned by Mrs. Louis Justin was the marked improvement in the quality of work among the ministry's staff who have received specialized training through the partnership. Moreover, Mrs. Louis Justin emphasized the tangible benefits witnessed in the current year alone, showcasing the ongoing commitment of both parties to making a real and lasting impact on St. Lucia's development. This year, we collaborate with the University of Vermont team to facilitate key projects in areas such as quantitative and qualitative surveys to assess the impact of inflation on local consumers, to establish the establishment of a school garden at the Camille Henry Memorial School, an interactive mapping project with the St. Lucia National Trust, and a social network analysis examining possible linkages among St. Lucian's non-profit organizations. Professor Thomas de Sisto from the University of Vermont underscored the resilience of the partnership, especially in the face of global challenges such as the COVID-19 pandemic. Professor de Sisto expressed his admiration for St. Lucia's commitment to maintaining and preserving the programs established through the collaboration, even during the difficult post-pandemic period. The University of Vermont and uh, the Department of Community Development and Applied Economics prior to the pandemic had programs in St. Lucia, but also in Belize, Honduras, Peru, Kenya, Dominica, Brazil, and several other places. And after 2020, this is the only one that still exists. Uh, I mentioned that. <laughs> Hopefully in the coming years, we'll be able to reignite several of those programs. Uh, but it, I think it just speaks to the uh, resilience and strength of this relationship, uh, knowing that we have partners here that we can work with, uh, knowing that there are people uh, who are here to uh, you know, who recognize the, the work that the students have done and that we can and learn and grow with. The University of Vermont has been a steadfast ally in St. Lucia's pursuit of development and growth, and both parties express their optimism for the future. As they celebrate 20 years of collaboration, St. Lucia and the University of Vermont are looking forward to continuing this fruitful partnership with the hope that it will continue to bring about positive change and advancements for many more years to come.